The Harlingen Arts and Heritage Museum held its annual Dia de los Muertos exhibit. It featured traditional music played by the Grupo Americantos and traditional dance music performed by the Matachines dancers. Inside and out, the museum was filled with people walking around as calaveras or skeletons. The traditional Mexican celebration included a very colorful and moving array of altars and memory of family, friends, and even pets. Altars were designed by people from the community. Between an exhibit, food, refreshments, people enjoyed traditional music and dance to honor their beloved ones. Uh, Dia de los Muertos, or the Day of the Dead uh, celebration, started here in Harlingen in 2004. 2004-2005, uh, we had a, an event at the Harlingen City Cemetery when we had the Harlingen Historical Preservation Society. And when the society uh, folded, the museum took over the event, and uh, it's been growing every year. She the event for the first time with her daughter. She enjoyed that the event shared culture and history of the Hispanic heritage and gave tribute to the historical figure, Cesar Chavez. It, is, it really shows our heritage. As me as a Hispanic, it shows what as a Mexican family would do to be grateful to the who have passed away, uh, who have died, Attendees from all over the valley were able to attend the exhibit, not only to learn about the culture and history of Dia de los Muertos, but to honor those who passed away. Phenomenal. This is my first time here. I've been in the valley for about six years, but I haven't been here, and I wish I would have been here more often, so it's absolutely phenomenal. The traditional Mexican celebration, Day of the Dead, also known as Dia de los Muertos, commemorates those who have passed away. All tours were decorated with pictures, candles, and objects that were favorites of that person. For UTRGV-TV, I am Dulce Cortinas.